What's going on guys? My name is Doug or Always on Board and in this tutorial I'm going to teach you guys how to put PSD files into After Effects and then there's going to be a part two where I show you how to do something and I'll get to that in a second. So the first thing you want to know is uh, this little tip that comes in handy if you want to be able to be quick with this. If you hit Command, Shift, and Tab and then you let go of Tab after you click it but you're still holding on to Shift and Command, it, it brings this up and on a PC it's Control, Shift, and Tab and then you just hold Control and Shift. This comes up and enables you to go through applications quick so that you can be smooth with it. So I have uh, Photoshop already open, so I can click on that. And what I'm going to be doing is uh, I'm going to be showing you guys how to use this Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4 logo and bring it into After Effects by the PSD file so that you can use all of its layers. So um, what I want to show you is there's three different or two different layers um, besides the background, which I have hidden because I don't care to transfer that over. And you can make your own creation, and I'll have this Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4 logo in the description for you guys to use if you'd like. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to save this. And I already have it saved to the desktop, and everything's ready. So now I'm going to hit Command, Shift, and Tab again, and I'm going to go into After Effects because I have it open. And so what I want to do now is, um, if you click around, you can see that there's this yellow-orange um, line that goes around each like uh, area. So I uh, make sure that you're on this area where the project tab is open, not the effects controls. And then once you're in this, you double click it. And so you can op open stuff up. And I'm gonna bring in this PSD file, which is the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4 logo that I created. Click on open, and then uh, you have uh, settings for how you're gonna bring this into After Effects. So I'm gonna import it as a composition. You have footage composition or composition retain layer sizes. And I'm gonna make it to where it's editable and click okay. And from there you can see that it brought it in as a composition and so you can double click on that once it's in and then you can see that there's layers here so um, command shift tab I can show you this again in Photoshop I had the, um, this unchecked where this doesn't even show this brush mark but it's still in there it brings everything that's in this PSD file into After Effects so let's go back into After Effects and you can see that the brush the brush was there and that uh, I can take it away and then I can just go like this and click on delete and it's gone. So what I wanted to show you is once the uh, PSD file is in, you are able to control everything as if you're in Photoshop. So each layer you can control and you can do whatever you want to it. So let's say I wanted to just move the, the logo down and then I can move the Modern Warfare 4 logo up. I can do whatever I want and if you don't like that, hit Command Z um, to bring that back or Control Z. And so that's pretty much it for this tutorial where you bring in a PSD and you're able to do things with it. So now for the part two of this tutorial, I'm going to have it at the very end of this video, but I'm going to be showing you right now what we're going to be doing with this logo that I've created. Now, a few uh, about a week ago, actually a few days to a week ago, I made a gameplay commentary where I talked about Call of Duty Modern Warfare 4, and this is what I put into it. So it's easy motion, a little bit of motion blur, and it's not too bad, and then it fades out. So that's going to be in the part two of this video. I hope you guys enjoy this, and I hope you guys leave some feedback. And stick around for part two, and make sure to subscribe because I'm going to have a ton of videos. Uh, my name is Doug, or always on board, and I'll talk to you guys later. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoy gameplay videos, go ahead and check out the video on the left. And if you guys want to see part two of this video, go ahead and check on the video on the right. My name is Doug, or always on board, and I'll talk to you guys later.